wins in the spirit has won. Are you aware? Completely. Maybe after a little while, you would see the result of the exploits in the spirit. If there is any way you can get into the spirit, do it. It's better. Anything that you don't like in the physical and you want to change, go spiritual. If it is settled in the spirit, then it is really, really settled. You must go completely spiritual. Refuse every attempt to reduce you to the physical. Did you hear what I said? Refuse it. Refuse it. You don't use something physical to fight the spiritual. That the journey of life is journey of spirituality. If the thing is happening by the spirit, you have to face it spiritually. That's why God gave us the force of prayer. When I say you have to, you, are not, you will not need to go physical, you will go spiritual. means that every work you are doing must be guided by what is written. That's why I've been championing it and I've been telling people, the prosperity and the success God talked about for Christians is good success. And for it to be good success, it must align with the principles and character of Christ. If not, there are so many things we can do to be called prosperous. But the one that God approves are the ones that follows his principles. If you're a man of the spirit, leave the crowd. Leave the crowd. Because the crowd rarely follows the spirit. We are interested in the cars, in the house, in the fame, in prosperity, but the right way.